Hello, children of a lesser joint. Today's segment is nothing more than a conversation. I wanted to give you an idea about future plans I have for the group. So, let me tell you what you may have already noticed. Number one is I've been trending towards shorter videos. Keep it short, sweet, and simple. I think it's better, especially for the summertime, that you'll be able to get a short capsule in, maybe do it during lunch, maybe do it before you go to sleep, in between patients if you're a doc, and you can get an idea about what I'm talking about. I think it is a little disruptive to do the short segments, however, because it doesn't help me maintain as much continuity as I would like. In order to overcome that, I have now posted all of the videos to my YouTube channel. And this is going to do two things. Number one is, you may not want to come to the site all the time. Especially because if you've not kept up with the videos on a regular basis, it's hard to find those posts, especially when other people have been posting in between, and so they get moved down on, on the group page site. So this way you'll be able to find the date of the lecture and be able to follow it in sequence. Number two is in the beginning when I started the video um, format, I asked you to bring your docs to the site. And part of the problem with getting docs to the site is they may not want the exposure on Facebook. So this is an alternative way in which you can give your physician or give your dentist a link without having them actually be part of the group. Beyond that, what's on the horizon? What are my future plans for the group? Well, right now I'm working on specific diseases and what I've been trying to do is, and you'll see this in the upcoming videos, is to give you a sense of what the big picture is here. How we're looking at the oral manifestations of systemic disease and then the counterpart of that, the systemic manifestations of oral disease. You're also going to get to see how I'm trying to cast a very large net to pick up what is involved with your particular joint, what are the other systemic diseases, and I'm also trying to get to a differential diagnosis in the hope that I can get better treatment and maybe better outcomes out of this. In addition to that, sometime towards the end of the summer as I'm finishing up lectures on individual topics, I'm going to level the playing field. I'm going to bring everybody back to a central beginning point and allow this to take off from that origination point where I can build this step-by-step step for both doctors and patients from the very beginning. So you're going to get to see lectures on how I do exams, how I put information together, how I format blood testing. I even will have a section on how both doctors and patients can do their own research, look for disease associations. So that's my plans for the future. That's how I'm going to rock it out with Jaw Talk and see if I can't light up the scoreboard for you even better. Have a great day.